Hey everybody, uh, once again, uh, thank you to everyone who made it to the premiere of the Meta National video. Uh, I'm very happy with how the video turned out and hopefully it gains some traction. Uh, in regards to what I'm working on next, if you didn't already guess it from the end of the Meta National video, I am going to be looking at series 11 of Thomas and Friends, but uh, I want to bring something up about that. I want to make something a little bit clear because I have been getting a lot of uh, comments on uh, my more recent videos and my more recent uh, posts, uh, community posts on YouTube about when I'm going to be looking at Series 11. When is the Series 11 review? Don't you know that Unlucky Tug already looked at Series 12 ages ago? And yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. It has been a lengthy amount of time since I looked at Series 10. Uh, and in that time, the Unlucky Tug has got ahead of me in his series of views. But in all honesty, guys, that was always going to happen. The Unlucky Tug does this full time, uh, like he does this YouTube thing full time. I only do this as a hobby, a very passionate hobby, which has to be supported by me working a uh, a part time job. That's the truth of it. So th this was inevitably going to happen. Uh, second thing I want to bring up on, on that is. If I ever seem, uh, <clears throat> if I ever seem like uh, I'm straying away a little bit from Thomas with uh, my recent uh, focus on uh, projects uh, like uh, the Cars uh, video games and a bunch of other stuff that I want to come that I want to make content on, I'm not abandoning Thomas. I'm never going to uh, let that series sort of like lie. I'm never going to let that series lie. I'm, not, I'm never going to not make another Thomas video ever again, despite the lengthy amount of like time between a uh, like, series of views. What I'm trying to do is try and cover more content that I... <coughs> <coughs> try and cover more content that uh, I'm passionate about. Uh, sometimes it doesn't always work, but because it's been doing relatively well, very well, uh, with uh, the Cars Projects... Uh, you know, with my review on the first Cars game, and hopefully this one, I want to make some more, uh, you know, stuff on that, you know, and 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 see what else I can cover, you know, maybe some Sonic the Hedgehog stuff. I I want to make sure I'm not just the Thomas guy, because one of my biggest sort of like existential fears uh, is if I do get to the end of the review series of Thomas and Friends, you know, I make it all the way to, say, series 24. My biggest fear is that if I get to it, nobody's going to want to watch my content anymore, if that makes sense. I know that my Thomas content does uh, the best uh, compared to other content on my channel, because that's where I, that's where I made my name for myself. For myself, I made my a name for myself in the Thomas community. It's completely understandable, but I don't just want to be the Thomas guy. I don't want to. I don't want to have that singular element to my channel. As 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 lovely as it as fa phenomenally fun as it is to get to make uh, videos about Thomas and friends in the first place, I don't want to have only that to my name out of fear of nobody watching anything else I ever make ever uh, ever if that makes sense which again that's probably just like a paranoia uh, because because I know uh, very loyal fans uh, will continue watching my stuff uh, regardless if it's Thomas or not and I'm very appreciative of that but I don't I don't want to be uh, I don't know, like, you know when an actor is, like, typecast, uh, typecasted, you know, for, like, one particular role that they become famous for, and then they're typecasted as that specific role over and over and over again. I don't want to be typecasted as a YouTuber. I don't want to be typecasted as a content creator. I want to expand into other areas that I'm passionate about, and hopefully uh, make an identity for myself that is... Definitely has Thomas and Friends as a big part of my life, but not just being the Thomas guy, if that makes sense. Anyway, that's all I wanted to clear. Thanks again for watching the Meta National video, and see you in a bit.